what up guys it's your boy k dre we're back at it again with another reaction i told you guys we're going to be doing the loop station alongside with the single battles hand to hand so now we're doing the frosty and robin if you guys are new to the channel hit that subscribe button because i do drop regular basis reactions to loop stations beatboxing all that with the singles tag teams you name it and we also go in order for each year so definitely don't want to miss out anyways let's go ahead and get right into it Welcome to the first quarterfinal of the SBX Kickback Battle 2021 Loop Station Edition mm. with the exclusive prototype of the boss RC505 Mark II. Today we have Frosty versus Robin. First up is Frosty with three minutes and 30 seconds on the clock. I say the three and I say the two and the one. Let's go. In three, two, one. one. Beatbox. Let's get it. Yo, Robin, I love your stuff, but it's time to battle. All right. I love how he's showing love, but say, hey, man, we about to battle. I like the attitude. This is what I like about Frosty. Yo, his sub bases is like an alien type shit. Like, it's crazy, man. <laughs> Okay. Go ahead. Oh, okay, he's cooking. Hold up. Ooh. Yo, does this give you the dubstep remix of of uh Midnight Club Dub Edition remix? This gives you that vibe, don't it? Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> I'm enjoying the dub electronic uh, vibes that he's bringing in it. Uh, also, he's doing great as far as he started off very strong. He didn't waste too much time. He also gathered his elements, bringing a live. Sh this, this is basically a live show right here that you get him, man. Crazy. He sound like a DJ right now. They reverse the Okay. And that's time. Wow. Round two, Robin. Switch. Okay, Frosty, let's do this. Wait the heck? What? This is doing a barn right now? 
He uh, he cooking in the haystack right now. That's what he about to do. Okay. Whatever he start making like some animal noise and start making the animal noises in there, bro. Like a sheep bat and the, the cow moo. He just start getting all these different animals and put them in, bro. That'd be the like, dopest theme ever, bro. With, with him being in the barn, that'd be dope. Only because he's in the barn, though. That's that's the only reason why I'm letting it slide, but. <laughs> What? You can try, it makes you sing on the good tune. We run on the same boat, but hey. my boat is smaller than yours. You should try, it makes you feel like a real looper. I'm just playing my game, playing my game, playing my game. He's doing good with his vocal stacking and the vocal range of how he's stacking in the vocals. They're not just, they're sitting right, basically. And also, this is very creative. I mean, it's not something that's like crazy, right? He's not doing something completely just like somebody just flipping off a high tower or something. Like, I mean, it's just, it's just the way how you do things. The way you, how you approach a scenario and it just shows you with creativity if you come with something you you're limit your, when you have limitations of certain things and you just get a little creative and think out the box what you can do this is really cool <laughs> Round three, Frosty, switch. Damn, Robin, you've got a very, very small boat.
Hold on, we gotta go back to that. He said, "Dang, you got a really small boat, bro." These guys' counters is crazy, bro. I'm glad they give him time in between. I, look, I was I had to make sure the wife is all good. She texts me, but I'm glad these guys literally get time to counter and come up with some catchy, cool stuff and also <laughs> some brilliant uh, counters when it comes to. Uh, these phrases they, they they do but that was funny he said damn robin you got a really small boat and then hit him with a pie for base as if it came from heaven literally god hold up audio is messing up damn robin you've got a very very small boat Okay, so I'm not tripping. This is when he does it. No. This sounds like the Sith is coming, like it's like the Sith Lord's coming in, like Darth Vader and stuff. Like, this does not sound like it. This sounds like it, right? Look, 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 look. This sounds crazy. Okay. No. No. Oh. oh. Bro, it's like we just went to, we just went from, just, it, it, it went from going to scene of battling the Sith Lords to now just a, a whole other level boss fight that I don't even know we went to a devilish round or what, but holy smokes. I want this to play in my arc when I go against any bad, like bad guys, the main villain, like that arc. I want this to play in the back scene of my gameplays or whatever that I'm doing. Like anything that, that dope, super dope, we gotta play this. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. This is what I was really expecting from Frosty. That's why I told you guys, look, y'all know. Like I was like, Frosty, I think it was the seating round. I was like, Frosty, bro. This is nah, bro. I know, I know his capabilities, bro. He's showing you guys his capabilities, bro. This dude is a beast. Frosty is a beast. This guy is nothing to play with. Don't let him get in his bag because he would do stuff like this. This dude just unleashed a whole hell round of an arc villain theme, theme song, bro. Come on. What are, you, what, what are we going to ask for from this guy? I mean, I don't even know what to ask for him anymore. He did the impossible with this.
Hey man, I'm I I gotta give it to Frosty, bro. I ain't gonna lie, Robin. I gotta get it, Frosty, bro. I gotta see what this round is, but right now I'm le I'm definitely into Frosty on this one. This was crazy. What? The Just witness, and that's time, bro. This is round crazy. four. Robin, switch. Come on, Robin. Massive respect to you, Frosty. I love who you are, and I'm gonna play violin just for you. One thing I would say, though, is I am definitely digging Robin's uh, creativity when it comes to being in immersive in different areas. And look at this alignment scene. Like, I don't know if he's into film or what, but bro, he is doing some, or photography, but look at this. The cinnamon, uh, cinnamon, whatever they call it, a cinnamon, whatever they call it, but basically how it's parallel, he's lining up parallel with the lines here. The car as well, he's centered in, your eyes go straight to him, leaning down with from the lines, he has the, uh, the bokeh, uh, bokeh a little bit. Where the trees are kind of, anyways, it's a little nerdy talk. Y'all don't really care about that. Y'all just want to see the um the the beatbox. But I'm just saying, the visualization. He doing some dope stuff. The car is moving, he's on top, and he's making the beat on top of the SUV, the van, truck, whatever it is. Bro, then we A1, bro. <laughs> love how this is what i love about the internet and the culture in general of people who love similar things is you could be in the middle of nowhere and still share the same amount of love and interest and just get creative still and put somebody in your world like this is his world that we get to witness bro and that's amazing <laughs> Yeah, I forgot how cold this dude is, man. My bad. My bad, Robin. Robin, my bad, bro. I, I forgot how cold he... I forgot, bro. Okay? That... Your, your range? Vocally? I don't really see a lot of people touching you other than a few in this, in this lead, bro. God. But it 
it's time to go Guys, and if you guys enjoy it, if you guys really enjoy it, man, hit a thumbs up and let me know down the bottom which one was your favorite performance. I still got Frosty because he, he really showed up, especially that last round. It was like a villain. But anyways, man, let me know what you guys think down in the comment section. Who is your favorite one that you like out of this performance? And also hit the subscribe button. This is your boy KJ. I'm out. Peace. It's crazy.